Hello, thank you for looking at the World War II 1943 Elgin A11 watch. Um, right now the watch is hacked, so I wanted to show you that the hacking mechanism is working. Uh, so we'll put that in, and there it goes. Um, it has the lid, has the dust cover lid for the movement. Um, it hasn't been serviced, but as you can see, it is running very well. Okay, um, let me put this back on for now. Okay, so this was purchased from an old watchmaker uh, estate. Um, it looks like as if maybe somebody brought this in for a service and either never picked it up or maybe they never even serviced it or got to the point of servicing it. It still has the tag on it. It has the original band. Everything on the watch is original. Um, dial hands, everything. Um, there's really not much I could say about it. I know the watch came from the an estate in Pennsylvania near Scranton. Um, it has the original base metal case, which I have to say is in decent shape. I mean, yeah, it has its nicks and dings, but for the most part, m almost all the chromium is still intact, which is pretty rare on these, as you know. Uh, the crystal looks newer. Um, wasn't replaced by me, but there doesn't seem to really be any scratches or anything on it. Nothing crazy. Uh, the crown is definitely the original uh, crown for the Wadsworth case. And... That is pretty much it. Everything's matching, serial numbers, uh, movement dates. Um, so this is a pretty good all original example. As you can see, the, the dovetail is missing on the second hand, which is pretty common on these, but it is the original second hand. Um, and it has the radium loom on the dial still intact with patina. And that's pretty much it. Thank you for looking.